Welcome back in. Fall is just hours away, and boy, you can feel the difference in how it feels outside. Fall equinox is at 9.04 p.m. That is when we officially usher in the autumn season. Normal high is 76. We are quite a bit below average thanks to a powerful fall cold front. Did you feel that breeze today? The chilly wind is due to the front that has passed on through. That cold front currently situated along the Atlantic seaboard, bringing some soaking rain showers for some of those big East Coast cities. Now behind that cold front, you've probably heard of lake effect snow, but what about lake effect rain? Yes, it is a thing. Lake Erie is still around 70 degrees and folks from Cleveland through Erie PA are seeing some lake effect rain showers due to the difference between the cool air behind the front and the mild surface of Lake Erie. No rain showers for us, but I do want to give you an alert that hazardous conditions are likely on Lake Erie as well as the beaches, so I would recommend avoiding the lake at least for the next 12 hours or so. Temperature wise, we are cool behind that front. 50 in Hillsdale and Southern Michigan. Get ready for the chilliest night of the season. Overnight low is going to drop down to the 40s and across Southern Michigan. It'll be even cooler than that 41. This is for the Toledo Metro folks up in Hillsdale and Lenawee counties could plummet to 39 or 38 degrees. Not expecting any widespread frost, but patchy frost across Southern Michigan could be just enough that you might want to cover up those sensitive plants outside as you're sleeping. Here's a preview of the coolest night of the season so far. As you wake up tomorrow morning, it'll be 41 in the metro, a few 30s possible, mainly north and west of Toledo. As we fast forward the clock into your Friday afternoon, temperatures only making it to the 60s. That free WTOL 11 weather app will pinpoint our overnight lows. We're going to drop down from 49 degrees at 1 a.m. all the way down to 41 by the time you wake up. Now, by the afternoon, it's actually going to be a pretty nice day. Still cool feeling, but we'll enjoy a little more sunshine. All that cloud cover that we saw today, that's going to thin out and also not as windy. The wind is finally going to diminish now that that cold front has long moved on through. But what about the weekend? The first weekend of autumn almost here, and it's going to bring us some classic fall weather. Saturday is going to be an overcast day with a couple sprinkles, but we want to pinpoint Sunday to bring more widespread showers and a breezy feeling day. Here is another cold front that's going to move on through. Saturday is going to be cloudy. Other than a brief sprinkle should remain dry. Now, Saturday night into Sunday, you'll notice the breeze start to kick up and a few showers will be more likely for the second half of the weekend. Overall, rain chances are still pretty slim at Susan G. Komen race for the cure 57 degrees with a rain chance at 30% for Sunday morning at 930. 10 day forecast featuring a chilly fall weekend. Temperatures do warm up and by the start of October, we'll be back to the 70s with an abundance of sunshine. Melissa.